Hi, I'm Dennis Gage, and welcome to My Classic Car. This week we're in Grand Junction, Colorado, to check out one of the most unique collections and certainly one of the most interesting collectors I've ever met. Tammy Allen runs a limousine service here in Grand Junction, and she just flat out loves cars. Over the years, she's amassed quite a few of them, and they all reflect her personality and eclectic tastes. This is just a sampling of them. Check these babies out. Well, Tammy, you're one of the most interesting collectors I've ever met in my life, and I've been doing this a while. <laughs> you have you have such a wild uh, array of cars, and and you know a lot of collectors, uh, you know, they have different themes. They're into foreign, or they're into a particular era, or whatever. But you seem to be, I like that, or that looks cool. Mm -hmm. That that's really your yeah, theme, right? It is. <laughs> Even my dad said that. He goes, "Cool," and I go, "Yeah, Dad." It's it's pretty. It's cool. I want so, it. Yeah, I want <laughs> and that I can. Car. Well, well, let's talk about you know some of these crazy things that you think are just really pretty or really cool. And you okay. like Sunny and Cher. That's why you I got. I love Sunny and Cher. This pair. This is. These were built by George Barris yes. for Sunny and Cher uh -huh. in like '66, right? Yeah. And, and where'd you find you, these? At Barrett Jackson. They, oh, you got these yeah, at the auction. Yeah, I did. Wow. Well, you know <laughs> these. <laughs> I mean, they are so '60s. They I mean, are. You, huh? you look at the. <laughs> Well, the, the, uh, yeah, the fur and the shag. Yeah. And did George work with uh, Sonny and Cher to, to... Yeah, George worked with Sonny and his wife uh, worked with Cher and on um, picking out the design, what colors and what they liked. Wow, well, you know, eight track tape, you know, with the exception of the garish uh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> shag and the fur, it's really a 66 Mustang, uh -huh. pretty much 289. I think they both have 289s. But then George did all these really wild things. He shaved the handles, and, and this is now your, mm -hmm. your door opener, right? Mm -hmm. yes. And these suede, suede inserts. Side. Yeah. Uh, if that isn't 60s, I know. I don't know what it is. <laughs> and they're great. I mean, they've been either really well cared for or very well restored. I like the fact that it's got kind of a, you know, a fade paint job. You see a little bit of mm -hmm. fade there, and they, yeah, you know, like George tricked too. up the taillights. And Sonny's have got, has got S on the center caps, and Cher's got C on her center caps. I like the front ends on them and uh, the treatment up there. Well, there's these scoops, which are sort of like ice cube trays almost <laughs> <laughs> bolted on there. And then, you know, the grill treatment's interesting, and I like the rectangular headlights on it. I think uh -huh. it really sets the car yeah. off. You know, it's, it, I mean, it's a, it's a, it's a George Barris car. It's an interesting looking car. But this one. <laughs> That one's wild enough, but pink. I mean, Tammy, this thing, and you're, you're sort of a pink it, nut anyway, I right? am. You are. Uh -huh. <laughs> the same things, the suede, this time red suede insert, hot pink shag carpeting. Mm -hmm. But I tell you, and, and if you don't mind, I got to open the trunk. You're okay with that, oh, right? Oh, yeah. Because the trunk just absolutely kills me with this car. If there wasn't I enough know. white shag carpeting, <laughs> <laughs> this, this is totally crazy. You could almost get in there and sleep. <gasps> well, and, and I guess that's the filler. I mean, this is where you put the gas in. You've got, you really don't want to spill because I would mm -mm. imagine that's like a gasoline sponge. I know, it would be. What a, you know, piece of history here. We've, not only is it Sonny and Cher, but it's George Barris doing it for him. And, but this is only a piece of it. You've got so many cool cars. A couple of caddies I ask you to pull out over at your place. We can go uh -huh. look at those, right? Yeah. Can you take them out and drive them and stuff? Yeah, that'd be great. We well, say we cruise over in a uh, 51 uh, Ford. Yeah, All right, let's, let's do it. That'd be fun. Welcome back to My Classic Car. Right this way, my dear. Thank you. This is riding in style. Yeah, <laughs> it's comfortable. So do you get these out much? Do you get to drive these cars much? During the winter, not quite as yeah. much because, you know, I don't want anything to happen to them. And so in the summer, as soon as it starts getting warm, 
we start getting them out. You know, I, I absolutely love the dashes of the 50s too. Just the, all the, you know, the trim and the gauging. I do too, and how big the steering walls are. Big and thin, yeah, but you know you got a car. Nice. I know. <laughs> you got something to hold yeah. on to here. So smooth though, huh? It is. And it's got just that right rumble too, that mm. flathead rumble. Now that, that's a couple nice caddies. Man. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, thank you. <laughs> thank you for bringing them out today. Let's, you know, I don't know where to start. Let's start here, because we're by this. Okay. This is a 38 caddy limo, right? Yes. And you have a limo business. So this I makes do. perfect sense, doesn't it? Yes. Where did you find this? I found it in Beverly Hills. Wow, I mean, a Beverly Hills caddy limo. What's, what stories this could tell? I know, that's what I was thinking when I got in the back. I was like, wow. I wonder who was in here, who was it's riding got Greta here. Garbo yeah, or, you know, I know. <laughs> Clark Gable. You yeah. know, you know. But these, you know, these are such elegant, they're massive, but they're elegant cars and so art deco. You know, I love the fact that it's got dual side mounts. It makes it look, you know, more balanced and, and, and again, just stately. But even these, these turn signals, you know, the three, three. chrome uh, bars on it and the big headlight buckets, it's just, it's beautiful. And the V16, I mean, <clears throat> we'll talk about that in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> and then inside, you know, beautiful. Banjo steering wheel, 16, Cadillac 16 on the horn button, Art Deco mm -hmm. in the instrumentation. It's, it's just beautiful. Even these delicate little sun visors. Yeah, it's nice. And then, of course, plenty of room in the back. Um, yeah, a lot of leg room. <laughs> a lot of leg. Is this used, like, what do people want this one for? Is this weddings. A wedding? It's a wedding car. Yeah, yeah, a lot of weddings and uh, anniversaries, stuff like that. Man. And I've used it in parades to... Well, that's got to uh, be a hit. Yeah, yeah. it's yeah. always... Nice. Even has the crank up window for privacy, or I imagine it's another windshield when you do have the top uh -huh. down. Uh-huh, yeah. But even back here, the bustle trunk. V16, that, that uh, is a rare engine. Not too many of them left. Can we go look at it? Yeah, All right. I'd love to. Okay, I'll uh, I'll attempt to open this for you. Okay. Because <laughs> this, this, this is a monster. If I recall correctly, I have to uh, caress this beautiful <laughs> angel here. That unlatches it. Then there's a safety latch under here, right? Uh -huh. Yeah. And then you get under it, and with a good heft, sure. off you go. Wow. So it's V16 with, with two carburetors, even. Uh-huh. My goodness. But the engine's gorgeous, too. I mean, this was a, really quite a nice restoration. I see why it was invited yeah. to Pebble. Mind if I chauffeur you around in it? Sure, I'd love it. <laughs> sure, so would I. All right, let's close it up. Welcome back to My Classic Car. And this came out of Beverly Hills? Uh-huh. Wow. Yeah. Really an elegant. I bet this, if it this car elegant. could talk. That's good. That's exactly what I thought when I got in it. What a beautiful car. Thank you. I think so. Is this, this, a, is this a fave? I was going to say, mm -hmm. is it a fave? Yeah. You can see why. Maybe this one. Wow. Tammy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. 38 caddy. <laughs> And I guess there's only about um, eight in, left. And, really? Yeah, because there was 300, I think, and something made then, and got the V16. Well, I love the styling, the late, the late 30s, that Art Deco, and the, the running boards, too. It's, so I sort of miss that, actually. I, I like running boards. I do, too. Well, and this car, front to back, looks beautiful. Even the, even the back of this car is so elegant. It is. I think, and it's got to be the first uh, 38 Caddy limo I've ever driven. Really? Yeah, yeah. Oh, good. I feel like I've got that chauffeur thing going, you know? <laughs> Well, Tammy, that uh, 38 V16 was really sweet, smooth, quiet, elegant, but this is a wild looking machine. It is. This is a 47 Caddy wagon, Woody wagon. And when you and I were first talking, you were telling me about this and I went, wait a minute, 
can't even make a 47 <laughs> woody wagon. <laughs> so this is a custom build, eh? Yes. So what did it start life as? A hearse. Oh, okay. Yeah. They had to, I mean, it's still monstrous, but they had to shorten it. Yeah, they did about 29 inches. It had to have been taller too. Yeah, it was. They shortened it two inches in the back, four inches in the front. You know, the color on this, I wouldn't have thought would do much for me, but on this car, it just works. It does. Not on too many other cars, but this one it does. I think the orange really helps too. The, you know, the wheels and the pinstripe. Mm-hmm, I think so too. So interior wise, they've, they've redone, they've done this too. I mean, completely. Mm -hmm. Vintage air, Stuart Warner gauges, good tunes. Yes, good tunes. Comfy seats. Uh-huh, really Oh, and the wood headliner. I mean, actually wood everywhere. The, the, the sides, the back, and with the, you know, with the maroon, the metal that they left and the stripes and everything, the thing looks like a freight train. This one's really fun to drive because you can just kick back, relax, and yeah. take off. Love the big skirts. I know, fenders. I do too. I think it makes the back look really neat. These look like 58 taillights, though, I think. that. Yeah. Huh? Mm -hmm. Wow. Now, now, as a hearse, it would have had this big uh, open out sideways door. Yeah, they split the door and made it clamshell. Made it clamshell. Can I open clamshell? it? Yeah, please. Yeah, so cool, I love this. Yeah. Oh man, that's, that's heavy, but yeah. nicely sprung. Look at that. Oh, look at this. <laughs> Tammy, that's yeah, awesome. I, isn't that pretty? Oh, and this with this look, you can see the wood top, bottom, sides. Now this uh, in 47 would have been powered by some, I guess probably caddy, flathead eight, but it's not anymore. No. Up, everything it's else not. is updated, so is the engine, right? Uh-huh. Let's go look at it. All right. Well, this one's a little bit more subtle than the other one, but it's still it's still a naked angel. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I think it opens the same way, right? Yeah. Okay, and I think that's the safety latch on this one. And off we go. Wow, so that's a, that's a 429 Caddy. Fits pretty nice in there. It just looks sweet. Now, does this, this runs well too? Just, you know? It runs really good. Just like it's supposed cool to? Stays cool and... How did I do with the 38? Very good. Did I do very good? Yes, you Would did. you like to be chauffeured around in a 47? I would, All I'd right. love it. I am at your beck and call. Okay. Right, right this way. Welcome back to My Classic Car. Wow. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. <laughs> that's really nice. Well, this this is a car that looks like you. This looks like one that you would you would go for. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> totally. It's elegant and it stands out, yet it's, you know, it's sporty. It's still got that kind of, it's a real subtle street rod job on it, but it's, you know, it's clearly a custom car. It is, because they, they don't know, I, just by looking at it, because a lot of custom cars, you're like, oh yeah, that's a custom yeah. car. This car, they're not sure. I know, it's, so, it's, it really <laughs> is a, it, it fakes you out. Yeah. <laughs> Sounds fantastic. And I love the uh, headliner. I know, I think that's cool in here. Yeah, a lot of work went into this. And I guess it's the roof is a 57 Chevy, Chevy station, station wagon. Station wagon, yeah. I like the visor too. That's a I nice feature. Too. That's really I think what really uh, has a nice look to it with the visor. Yeah, I think it is too. I really appreciate people that have this kind of talent. So do you take this out much? I do, this one. Because you, you can just nice. drive it. Yeah, you can kind of relax and drive this car. And the people enjoy it. People <laughs> enjoy seeing it. This is a cruiser. 